Good day, ladies and gentlemen, to the Gold Royalty and Max Silver's quarterly update on Commodity TV. And we continue with very good quarterly figures for our companies. Gold Royalty reported strong revenues in the second quarter this year, with a 300% increase in total revenues compared to the same period in 2023. The Cote Royalty acquired in 2022 commenced payments in the second quarter this year. Gold Royalty recorded preliminary total revenue with land agreement revenue and interests of $2.2 million in the second quarter of 2024, an increase of 298% over the same period in 2023, representing 947 gold equivalent ounces called GEOs. For the six months ended by 30th June 2024, the company recorded preliminary total revenue, property contract revenue and interest of $6.4 million, an increase of 153% over the same period in 2023 and 2,967 GEOs. In the second quarter this year, the company recognized the first royalty payment from IAM Gold's Cote Gold Mine and continued to benefit from its existing cash flow royalties on the Bobarama project and the Canadian Malartic, Cozumel and Borden mines. The company's royalty generation model generated $400,000 in property contract revenue during the quarter. As previously announced, the company anticipates further revenue growth in the second half of 2024 due to strong commodity prices the expected ramp up of commercial production in Cote in the third quarter of 2024 and the commencement of commercial production at the Vares project in the fourth quarter of 2024. The company remains on track to meet its previously announced updated 2024 guidance of approximately 6,500 to 7,000 geos, representing approximately 13 to 14 million dollars in total projected revenue, property contract revenue and interest. The above forecast for 2024 is based on an assumed gold price of $2,000 per ounce and copper price of $4.25 per pound, as well as public forecasts, expected development timelines and other disclosures from the owners and operators of the properties underlying the interest as well as our own estimates. The point and figure chart has bottomed and shows a great entry level. We have an initial price target of three US dollars and then four US dollars. In the longer term, five and a half US dollars should then come into play again. Max Silver also delivered super quarterly production figures. The all grade forecast was also raised, which will benefit profitability. Throughput at Juana Sipio was increased and 336,593 tons of ore were processed in the second quarter, further increasing the daily processing rates. In line with the first quarter, all ore was processed at the Juana Sipio plant in the second quarter. The continuing high grades are great, I would say even fantastic. The average silver grade of the ore was 498 grams per ton, ladies and gentlemen. This is exceeding the previous quarters and also exceeding our estimates. This further confirms the high grade nature of the Juana Sipio deposit, which continues to demonstrate its, its significant long term potential. Metal recovery is improved compared to the previous quarter, highlighting the ongoing operational improvements and circuit optimizations at Etwana Sipio. Commercial production of pyrite concentrate commenced during the quarter, resulting in increased silver and gold recoveries. Juana Sipio exceeded expectations with preliminary production estimates of 5 million ounces silver and 9,267 ounces of gold. All grade guidance has been revised upwards due to continued above average operational performance in the first half this year. The silver grade at Juana Sipio is expected to be between 420 grams and 460 grams per ton in 2024. Previously, it was estimated 380 to 420 grams per ton. Compared to the second quarter of 2023, Juana Sipio's performance has improved significantly, reflecting the progress made since the mine ramp up began and the plant was commissioned in February 2023. Importantly, the second quarter performance was achieved solely at the Juana Sipio plant, with no additional processing at the Fresnillo and Saucito plants. We like Max Silver a lot, and honestly, our price target is easily around the 35 Canadian dollar level. You can also find all the information on our Commodity TV app in German and English as well as everything to do with commodities. We look forward to your like and more importantly, please subscribe to our TV channel. Please note the disclaimer. The shares discussed are part of the SRC Mining Special Situation Certificate and I'm a shareholder in the companies. Thanks for watching us and Servus from Austria.